Okay, guys, so I made a new trade here. I'm trading away the Negev uh, Desert Strike and some cases and the Mag 7 Stat Track Minimal Wear. Um, this adds up to 36 cents, which gives us about, um, I would say, uh, well, I can't even do a calculator right now. <laughs> So 72 minus uh, 36 we said, yeah, so uh, 36 cents profit, yeah, uh, I was going to say 38, so yeah, 36 cents profit there, and I guess I'll see you in the next trade. Okay guys, so I swapped two Phoenix cases for uh, Mag 7 Heaven Guard and another Mag 7 Heaven Guard, so the same thing, both minimal wear, um, they're the equal prices, it's just that they are, um, they're not uh, cases, <laughs> as basically the word. Uh, I just posted some uh, trades here, and I bet you all these are fishers. Yep, they're all fishers. Block, block, and okay, I can't even block you. Block, and then you are a fisher as well. So go away. Um, that's the trouble. You got to watch out for the level zero profiles, and I'm gonna have to go through these offers and stuff. Um, but yeah, no money made there. Just switching stuff like cases for actual weapons which are easy to sell compared to a phoenix case if you know what i mean um but yeah guys i'll see you in the next trade okay guys so i traded basically all my consumers for a p90e scorch souvenir um just get oh those consumers really i know it's a souvenir and it's a consumer uh consumer souvenir but at least it's something better than all those consumers because to be honest those consumers are hard to sell uh i did accidentally put the industrial in there so it kind of made price equal, uh, but there was no other um, no other consumers to put in, and he was like, "Oh, I'll just put that in." So uh, yeah, um, basically a break even there. Um, we've had several break evens recently. Um, they're just to get easier items to sell than what we had, like cases or consumers or bad skins that are hard to sell. So I do equal trades because people want the skin to their collection. Um, just to get those easiest skins to sell really um, so yeah see you in the next trade guys okay guys so I traded three Phoenix cases for an AK jungle spray field tested uh, that gives us two cents profit but that just gets rid of the cases basically and that's my phone going off <laughs> uh, but yeah basically that's just us getting rid of the cases so I guess I'll see you in the next trade okay guys so I swapped the Glock Death Rattle, the SSG Abyss, and the Souvenir Negev Kali Camo. I swapped it for a factory new P250 Supernova. Um, so the Negev was 50 cents, these two were 20 cents, which gives us a profit of 7 cents. I know it's not a lot, like I say, with every single trade, but it's just swapping weapons for better weapons to get an advantage of having good weapons to get to like more classifieds to upgrade those classifieds into coverts and then the coverts into a knife so that's what i'm trying to accomplish uh right now really is because um i'm probably about five dollars off a knife right now um i know it won't be a great knife but uh yeah at least it's a knife and to be honest if i get a knife then i'll be quite proud starting from 50 cents of drops really and uh yeah guys i'll see you in the next trade Okay guys, so I swapped the fuel tested uh, Desert Storm M4 for a P90 module, uh, they're the same so no profit made, uh, it's just it's a better quality and I would say it's easier to sell, this is quite hard to sell, uh, well the fuel tested one is anyway and it's, you know, easier to sell P90, but uh, yeah guys I'll see you in the next trade. Okay guys, so I'm trading the Supernova for 5 Phoenix cases and this is probably about... Uh, I would say this is about 10 cents, 60 cents, uh, plus another 70 cents, that's $1.30, which means that we have a profit of around, I would say, 53 cents, yeah, 53 cents profit, so yeah, guys, I'll see you in the next trade when this uh, thing comes through. Okay, guys, so this guy looks like he wants a deagle pretty bad, um, basically, uh, this is 65 cents, that's 40 cents, um, so that's $1.05, that's 10 cents. So that's $1.15, 25, 35, 45. Uh, I would say $1.55 there, which is quite good really. Uh, we'll have to wait for this to go free, but yeah, $1.50 minus 70 we had equals 80 cents profit. So uh, yeah, guys, um, hopefully this will come through in a second. And uh, yeah, guys, I'll see you in the next trade. 
Okay guys, so I got another trade here. I just swapped a Huntsman case and a Tech 9 Army Mesh for System Lock. Um, no profit made there, unfortunately, but uh, yeah, it's just getting rid of those uh, getting rid of those cases and consumers, really. Um, hopefully I'll get rid of these soon, because this is unneeded, like this area, to be honest now. Um, yeah, and uh, I guess I'll see you in the next trade. Okay guys, so I have a bit of profit here, 3 cents profit, um, but yeah, those will have go through, but 2 AK red uh, red lines, uh, Safari Mesh is making 3 cents profit, so yeah, see you in the next trade. Okay guys, so I have a new trade here, I'm trading away the MAC-10 Curse, the P250 Supernova, the M4 Basilisk, and some other skins, adding up to $2.50 for a $2.80 Sword Off Crack and Feel tested. Um, that gives us a profit of 30 cents, um, that's just to get us, you know, another skin instead of having, like, consumers and maybe some other, like, you know, lowish tier skins, um, which is quite good, so yeah, 30 cents profit, and I'll see you in the next trade. Okay guys, I have a USB Guardian, I swapped it for a P2000 Pulse, a M4 Desert Storm Minimal Wear, and an AK Safari Mesh, uh, I overpaid about 5 cents, but... To be honest, I could probably sell this $1.10 anyway. So that's a break even there. Just upgrading more skins into better skins. And upgrade those better skins into better. And uh, try get this big item near the end really. So uh, yeah, I'll see you in the next trade. Okay guys, so I'm getting an SG Pulse here. Uh, for a break even price just for cases. So it's easier to get um, to trade these weapons and cases. And uh, this guy wanted some cases. So he sent me this trade offer. And uh, yeah, um, another break even there, probably about 3 cents profit actually, if you, yes, 3 cents profit on that actually. So uh, yeah, I'll see you in the next trade. Okay guys, so I'm trading away the USB Cayman, the AK Black Lamb and a P250 Splash for a USB Orion and 50 cents of spare stuff here. Um, so the USB Orion's $8.80 and the rest is just 50 cents, so $9.30 for our $9.30 here. Um, so an equal trade again, but we're upgrading to a better skin, and yeah, that's quite good for us really, uh, just upgrading the inventory. And I guess I'll see you in the next trade.